Hello, my name is Bobby. I'm here to talk with you about an exercise that a student has submitted. Suppose the lengths of the pregnancies of a certain animal are approximately normally distributed with mean mu 171 days and standard deviation sigma 17 days. What's the probability a random sample of size 18 will have a mean gestation period within 12 days of the mean? Now look at this formula that I've written here. Sigma is the population mean. Sigma sub x bar is the standard deviation of the sample means. Imagine that you have a very large number of samples of size 18. Each one of those gives you an x bar. Those x bars are distributed and they, they, their standard deviation is equal to the standard deviation of the population divided by the square root of the sample size. Notice that the larger the sample size, the tighter the distribution. Now in this case, 17 divided by the square root of 18, almost exactly 4. Now we're going to use this 4 to work with the, the 12 days that was in the question. 12 days is almost is 3 times 4 days. So 12 days is almost exactly 3 of the sample means. So let's have a look at this. The probability that z is between negative 3 and positive 3. The probability that z is more than negative 3 but less than positive 3. Now that's equal to the, the probability that z is less than 3 minus the probability that z is less than negative 3. I looked these up in a table. You could use a calculator. I got 0.99865 minus 0 0.00135, and that came out to 0.9975. It's a virtual certainty. It's just about impossible that you could have a sample mean that is more than 12 days away from the population mean. Now let's talk for a second about the 171 days. That was in the question as a distractor. You don't need it. You don't need it because we are only interested here in the deviations. I incidentally, you could have said, what is the probability that the sample mean is more than 159 days and less than 183 days? But it wouldn't change anything here. The answer would still be that the probability is 0.9975. Thank you.